Today, you'll learn how to do keyword research on Etsy using Keywords Everywhere so you know the most popular keywords you should be adding to your product listings. So let's get started. Okay, so doing keyword research on Etsy is very, very simple if you have keywords everywhere. Okay, so to do keyword research on Etsy, make sure you have the Keywords Everywhere extension installed and have it turned on. You also need to purchase credits for this to work. Okay, so now that you have that, go to Etsy, and if you click on this search bar, you can see some popular search terms uh, right now. And right next to these keywords, you can see some specific level keyword data. So you can see the monthly search volume for these specific keywords. You can see the average cost per click, competition score, and the monthly search volume over the past 12 months. Now, if you hover over uh, these graphs here, you can see the specific search volume for their respective month, okay? And a couple of things to note about this data is that this data is specific to the country that you have selected. So right now, I have the United States as a country, but you can change it to any available country right here. You can even do global. So depending on the location that you have selected, the data will reflect that country, okay? Another thing to note is that this data is coming from Google. So this is the Google uh, monthly search volume, cost per click, and competition score, all right? Um, but of course, the keywords listed here are coming from Etsy. So let's just say, you know, maybe we are a coffee mug uh, store, or we're thinking about building out a store to sell coffee mugs, and we want to do keyword research around coffee mugs, right? So if you search for that term, right below that term, you can see specific keyword level data for that. So you can see the monthly search volume, average cost per click, the competition score, the monthly search volume over the past 12 months. So you can see out of the year, what years are coffee mugs most trending. And there's a couple of new elements here. This one is a star. So say for example, you like this keyword, you can star it and save it to your favorites list within Keywords Everywhere. And this link here, uh, if you click on this link, Keywords Everywhere will do some keyword research around coffee mugs. Okay, so I clicked it just a moment ago and this chart will appear, okay? So Keywords Everywhere found close to 100 Etsy keywords for coffee mugs specific to the US. Now remember, I have the United States uh, set. So keep in mind, uh, this list of keywords is coming from Etsy. Okay, but the data here is coming from Google. So the search volume, cost per click, competition is coming from Google. And you can go through here, do your keyword research, find the ones that are most relevant to you, go through, I would go through and sort by search volume, see which keywords that are relevant to me have high search volume. Say for example, maybe you wanna go a little bit deeper and only focus on keywords that have a search volume between 100 and 1000. You can add that as a filter and Keywords Everywhere will only show me the keywords with the search volume between 100 and 1,000. And you could do the same process for cost per click, competition, and also trending percentage. And then you can also reset the filters to undo everything. And if you go through here, and if you find some relevant keywords that you want to save uh, for the future, you can just click on the stars, and these keywords will be added to your favorites list, All right? Another thing to note is that on the top right, you can check this for strict exact match. So that basically means coffee mugs, this exact phrase in this exact order must be within all of these keywords. So this basically just narrows down your list of keywords to only show the ones that have this phrase coffee mugs shown exactly like that within the keyword phrase. Okay, so since we are on Etsy and focusing on more product-specific keywords, um, this might not show too much of a difference be because coffee mugs is just one product. But if it's more of like a phrase, uh, this might be a little bit more helpful for you. Okay, 
And then you can also export all of this data. You can copy this and paste it on maybe a Google spreadsheet. You can export this as an Excel file, CSV file, PDF, or even print it out. And you can even add all of these keywords. So if you click on this red button, all of these keywords will be added to your favorites list so you can refer to it at a later date. All right, so this is a quick and easy way to do keyword research on Etsy so you know what are the best keywords uh, to add for your product titles, your descriptions, and maybe figure out what kind of products to create and sell on your Etsy store. So hopefully you thought this video was helpful and we will see you in the next one. All right, hopefully you enjoyed this video. If you did, make sure to hit that like button and subscribe to our channel. If you wanna learn more about Keywords Everywhere, feel free to click any of the videos on the screen. Thank you, and we will see you next time.